The Duchess of Cambridge was left in fits of giggles today after whizzing down a slide on the first day of her solo trip to Denmark. Kate was at the Lego Foundation Play Lab in the Danish capital to learn about how it is a creative learning environment for students who are training to be early years professionals. The Play Lab has a huge slide that Kate was shown the top of, and she could have taken the stairs back down to the ground. But daring Kate opted to have a go herself at the twisting slide and couldn't contain her laughter as she appeared at the bottom with her hands in the Kate Middleton comes whizzing down a slide during a visit to the Lego Foundation Play Lab in Copenhagen, Image, Reuters. She then said, in the spirit of where I am, I had to do that. Kate arrived in Copenhagen earlier today on a fact-finding mission to learn how the country has become a world leader in its approach to early childhood. She looked stunning in a red blazer from Zara that she previously wore when watching the England v Germany game at Wembley during the Euros last summer. Kate beamed as she shot out of the end of the slide, image, Ritzau Scanpix, AFP via Getty Ema. Kate said, in the spirit of where I am, I had to do that, image, Reuters. Love the Royals? Sign up for the Mirror's daily newsletter to get all the latest news on the Queen, Charles, Kate, Wills, Meghan, Harry and the rest of the firm. Click here to sign up. Underneath she wore a ruffled white shirt, with the red and white colors a nod to the Danish flag. She teamed it with black wide-legged trousers, a small black aspinal of London handbag and earrings and a necklace from Monica Vinader. Kate wore a blazer from Zara and teamed it with black wide-legged trousers, image, Reuters. Most read. Mum crushed to death at gym trying to lift 400 pounds barbell the weight of a gorilla. UK weather forecast. Exact date storm Gladys will bring snow, wind and torrential rain. Queen's stinging remark about Kate Middleton's lack of career and luxury life. On her first engagement, she visited the University of Copenhagen to learn from world-leading researchers running the Copenhagen Infant Mental Health Project, which aims to promote mental well-being and relationships between infants and their parents. She later went to the Children's Museum, where she met with three health visitors who have been trained through the Understanding Your Baby, UYB program, and two families who have benefited from this support. Kate is on a two-day solo trip to Copenhagen, Image, Reuters. Kate is spending two days in Copenhagen on a working visit with her Royal Foundation Center for Early Childhood. It is the first time she has taken the work of her foundation, which she launched in June, to the international stage. The visit will also pay tribute to the historic ties Britain shares with Denmark and celebrate the country's joint jubilees. The Queen's Platinum Jubilee and the Golden Jubilee of Denmark's Queen Margrethe II both fall in 2022. Kate will receive an official welcome from Queen Margrethe tomorrow in honor of the long-standing relationship between the two royal families. She will also join Crown Princess Mary of Denmark and visit a project which works to protect vulnerable women and children from domestic violence. Read more. Kate Middleton recycles Zara Blazer as she kicks off solo royal visit to Denmark. Read more. Competitive Kate Middleton and William to go head-to-head -head during tense royal outing.